Jerry Corbetta, famous for the band Sugarloaf, has died. He was 68. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. He was the lead singer and keyboardist for hits like Green Eyed Lady and Don't Call Us, We'll Call You. In the late 60s, Corbetta joined up with guitarist Bob Weber to form Chocolate Hair with drummer Mylon Pollock and bassist Bob Raymond. They made a few changes to the band, most notably the name. Like the label thought that Chocolate Hair would incite some racial issues. So at the last minute, they became Sugarloaf, the name of a mountain outside Boulder, Colorado. In 1970, Corbetta's Hammond B3 organ fueled their very first hit, Green Eyed Lady, a tune he co-wrote which reached number three on the charts. The problem with Sugarloaf is they never really had two great songs back to back. At least they never had two songs at the level of Green Eyed Lady back to back. It took another five years for their second hit, Don't Call Us, We'll Call You, which was loosely based on their experience on getting Green Eyed Lady on the radio station and that insidious tone of the industry. And of course the title is still an infamous term used in the music business. Don't Call Us was an incredibly infectious song and it was another co-write for Corbetta. And that thick organ riff he created which partners with the snippet of the Beatles' I Feel Fine after the lyric sounds like John, Paul and George was classic. It also sampled Stevie Wonder's hit Superstition. There was even an imitation of Wolfman Jack by disc jockey Ken Griffith. The cool thing was when Sugarloaf guested on the Midnight Special, Wolfman Jack was the host and he finally had a chance to say the lines from Stereo 92. The song reached number nine on the charts in 1975. Corbetta went on to become a member of the Four Seasons from 1980 to 84. He also joined the classic rock all-stars but had to retire because of his disease in 2009. He was diagnosed with Pick's disease, a type of frontotemporal dementia. Corbetta died in a hospital in Denver yesterday. I'm John Bowden. Make sure you comment on our videos and subscribe to our channel. We'll also check out your videos. This is Rock History Music.